competition and goals. Stay with us on EA TV as he tries for more. been building up all day long and we're almost ready for kickoff here at Stamford Bridge. What can he do with it now? Certainly in the news, Kingsley Coman, and the reports have been confirmed. He will, in fact, end his career at the end of the season. No two ways about it, Stuart. A big loss for the club. Yes, it really is. Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score! And a goal! That could make all the difference! They'll be determined not to lose this lead! Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. This is a very good finish. He just does enough to get it over the keeper. He'll certainly be pleased with that.
enjoyed bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up. It's Chelsea facing Bournemouth. Real chance. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, here it is again. He goes past these markers so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But just look at the space he has. He doesn't even have to jump. Of course it's a good finish, but the market is woeful. Well, back to the drawing board. This job defensively. There's the final whistle, and the visitors move on. Well, you can't say they didn't deserve it. They were by far and away the better team over the two legs, and the result was never much in doubt. I'm sure they'll face a sterner test in the next round, but they'll be full of confidence off the back of that performance. I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. But he should be pleased with himself today, because he performed really well, he scored a good goal, and they won the game. An excellent day all round. is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. Stay with us, every kick of the ball is coming up on EA TV. This is a stadium that absolutely oozes history. Here we are at the San Siro in Milan. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here, and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. Pinto's lineup is as follows. Well, in this formation, the wide centre backs need to be good all round players, both in possession and defence. Can't miss, surely. Just look at his movement, he knows exactly how to find space, and it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. Amadou Onana. Ezzy. Oh, he's beaten his opponent. been coming. They've played some great football in this game and they fully deserve this goal. Pictures are coming thick and fast. It should be a good game that. Hopefully I've not just given it the commentator's curse. Now he must favour the cross. Opportunity! I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal.
Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing... Patient build-up at the moment. Now this could really lift spirits. Oh, chance taken! There was opportunism for you, but a disappointed goalkeeper. In the first leg of this tie. Well, they'll be pleased with that victory, but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg, and I think they'll be confident, but it's going to be tight, that's for sure. in the final analysis a really positive performance from this man Stewart well he was a major reason why they won today he was so reliable and he inspires those around him our camera lens trained on one man in terrific form and top scorer in the competition. Stay with us on EA TV as he tries for more. Welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis. Alongside me is Stuart Robson. And we're ready to bring you the second leg of this UEFA Champions League semi-final. Well, when you're leading, you can afford to be pass happy. this bit of play just look how he runs with the ball he always looked in control didn't he that's a brilliant goal well they might be able to launch a counter attack Well, what a good performance that's been over the two legs. They've really controlled the tie, and if they play like that in the final, they've got every chance of lifting the trophy. Well, I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.
most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? The action is next on EA TV. the night everyone in the football world has been longing for millions will be watching around the world it is of course the biggest final in club football the uefa champions league final welcome to the commentary box derek ray here joined by stuart robson his football friends facing manchester city quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty yes, yellow card no. This to make it 1-0. Take another look. He deceives the goalkeeper really well here by getting to dive one way before placing it into the opposite side. A really good penalty. Playing it in and making sure it wasn't problematic. And try his luck here. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. This is a really good goal. He skips past his marker and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. Michel. Phil Foden now. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Well, disappointing end to the move. forward and the break looks on a real opening now Again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one foot in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. What can they do to stop them running at them? And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Spanish capital. Come 
possibilities inside the box. That's eyes for goal! Well, he so badly wanted to net another one, but the keeper playing his part. Maybe that should have been his second, but you can see another one coming. He's playing so well here.
separated. And so in this Champions League final, it comes down to a shootout. of any footballer in it goes can he get the better of the keeper superbly done how many players would try that and there it is perfectly executed goalkeeper beaten from the spot well, it's all about keeping a cool head. And it wasn't the greatest penalty, and it's been saved by the keeper. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. So lethal in front of goal, and he steps up to take the shot. And slots it home right into the bottom corner. Excellent penalty. Lineker, as always, in front of goal. So much pressure. If he fails to score, they lose. Well, he fired it straight down the middle. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. today, such a tight game that you have to feel sorry for the losers, they were so close and yet so far away and the party moon has enveloped the stadium, it's going to be quite the night of celebration here of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Well, the celebrations are ongoing. I don't think they're going to be brought to an end anytime soon. As they say for the moment with their supporters. They've certainly played their part, the fans. They deserve to be involved with these celebrations. They've made so much noise here. 